Hey guys, um, uh, today I'm going to show you how to insert tiles in more depth. I'm going to, as you can see, these are just the normal fire red tiles, different color, but normal tiles, and I'm going to switch them out for this sort of rock thing. So let's get started. First, I'm going to copy this image, you know, pretty simple. Um, I have two paints opened. In one, I'm going to paste it. Take out this tool. Uh, let's zoom in a bit. And I'm going to... Well, actually, first let's do this. So, press the puzzle piece. I'm going to find the palette color that is the rocks I want to use. So, I found it right here. So, I'm going to picture, save tile set 1, save it as tile set 0, save it as whatever you want. Now, I'm going to open this in the other paint and my document no it's on desktop <sighs> all right here it is right there so now I have this up so now I'm going to go to this one and I'm going to cut out this thing right here copy uh, right here uh, extend this line so I can work and paste it. Um, now it's time to recolor it. Now this is one of the hardest parts, but then again, even this part's pretty easy. Just gonna find the lightest color and find the lightest color I have here. And just go over it, get all the color, that kind of thing. Um, so I'm just gonna do this real quickly. Actually, not real quickly. This does actually take quite a bit of time, guys. Don't think you can just rush through this part. No, this part takes time. The recoloring is one of the stupider parts of doing this whole thing. And sometimes you notice there's more than one color there, and you're like, okay, what do I do with that? See, I don't like the way that looks, so I'm going to start this again. I'm going to use this really light color again with this. And we'll take this color and we'll do it with this take the main color as this um, and just it's just all about what you prefer how you think things should look all this plays a part in this um, uh, we'll do this with this brown again too Sometimes you have to do more than one color and trust your personal judgment. I mean, there's just no other way to do this. Just try and do it as well as you can and as masterfully as you can so that it looks well but still the same color sort of thing. Um, so far it's looking alright. Once again, I always back up your ROM. I. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, I did back up my ROM. I saved it as just in case I don't like the way this looks. I don't have to go into all this work turning it back. I can just load it. So keep that in mind. Always back up your ROMs, guys. It's I can't stress that enough. So already this isn't looking that great, but I can always change the palette to make it look a little better. But we'll see. Um, we'll see how this plays out. We'll do some lighter colors in here. Um, maybe some darker colors for this one. Oops, eraser tool. And this little thing right there. Okay, so we got this. Um, I'm going to change these these colors to black. Um, the background tile sort of things. And same with this. Also, you want to do this outline here. Make sure you get that. There we go. Uh, didn't all work too well. Just make sure you get it all. Um, if any colors are there that you that aren't supposed to be there, you, you'll see what it'll do. Because I think that might happen to me, but we'll see. Um, it'll just turn into a random like color that's stupid. I think in this one it'll be like that bright this bright green here. So now I'm just gonna, since this is preset to the size, I'm just gonna slide it over and put it in place. Now I'm noticing it's a little larger. 
I don't know, I can just move over another pixel. Alright, it's all good. There we go. So I'm just going to plunk that right there. Zoom out a second. Um, bring this back. Um, file, save, then simply go in advanced map, go picture, load tile set 1, 0, wait, and you can see it's still the same, but you go file, load new blocks, and it should change for the most part. But, um, you'll see that this part is still screwed up, because, um, one sec guys. Anyway, sorry about that guys. Anyway, because you can see here that this top part here is being covered by this top part here, but this bottom layers here have to be changed. And the way we do this is, well, you got to get that bottom sort of ring around it. Um, I'm going to show you a technique I use. Uh, so I'm going to need another one of these. Copy, edit, paste. And I'm simply going to, first of all, actually I'm going to need two of these, because I'm going to need these this um, middle kind of thing, so I'm just going to, I uh, shouldn't have done that. Ugh. Just whatever. Um, so I'm just going to find this kind of center piece that I want, which will be right... Uh, here, this little center thing. So then I'm going to want to go to this, this, make it black. Actually, not yet, but yeah, not yet, but we will be doing that. But first, we need to grab this part right here. This little, you see, this kind of blocks here, and we're going to have to turn this, or sorry, just copy it and whatever. It, paste it and turn it all black. I don't care how you do it, just turn it all black. Oh, sh Actually, it'd probably be better if I just went like this. Jesus. Cut. Alright. So now we have this black square, and you're going to want to try and center it like it is over there. Hmm. Centering it's pretty hard. <sighs> Let's use a guide sort of thing, which I will need another one of these, I guess. Well, actually, no, this guide thing isn't going to work. It's hard to get this to plan out the way you want it to, guys. I mean, um, I'm going to try here, make my own little kind of grid. I already screwed it up. Oh, well. Let's take a guess. <laughs> I really don't know what to do. Um, It'll be about right... I could do this if I had this red going all the way up. Oh, but I fucked up the thing. Okay, I'm retarded. Alright, guys, one sec. I'm just gonna make a grid thing. Alright, sorry. Um, so now that we have this, we can sort of judge. It has to be one there. About this, and... Belt there looks right. Let's just double check here. Yeah, this is right. So, we're going to make this black. Um, we're going to take this and we're going to copy it and paste it a bunch of times beside each other. And the same sort of thing as this. Edit, paste. Edit, paste. So I'm going to do this off screen just because I'm running out of time, so we are back. Alright, you can see I have my color back to the black background and that one clicked, so we're just going to outline this entire thing. And we're going to drag it so it fits just perfectly over this. And we're going to change this to black, and we're going to lift this whole mass over this right here. And there you have it, guys. That should do the bottom part. Um, file save. Picture load tile set one, tile set zero. Wait for it. Picture load new blocks. 
And just like that, you can see this is a lot better. Now already I can tell I don't like this top tiles here, but as you can see, it works perfectly all the way around. Except for, um, it, with an exception of these corners, which I would have to um, bring in also because the corners are actually right here. But I will do that in my own time because I'm out of time for this video, guys. So rate, comment, subscribe. Um, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time.